thousands of flights all over the country have been canceled today, and this time it's not because of a winter storm. It's all due to a computer outage. News 12's Noel Lilly is at LaGuardia Airport with the details. Yeah, that's right. And according to the flight tracker Flight Aware, earlier today, LaGuardia was reporting the most flight delays in the entire country. The Federal Aviation Administration stopped flights early this morning, but were finally able to lift the ground order around 9 a.m. So far, hundreds of departing flights have been delayed and over 80 have been canceled here at LaGuardia. The numbers are a little better at JFK, but those delays are also in the hundreds. The FAA is still investigating what caused those computers to crash in the first place, but we do know that the outage affected how flight crews received their safety information. Travelers we spoke to here at LaGuardia said that this is giving them flashbacks to last year's chaotic holiday travel season. We actually got really lucky during the holidays. We flew out before the polar vortex and we flew back in right after it. So maybe this is karma. I don't know, but you know, we'll see. You know, we're headed to Miami, so hopefully we'll get there today. By chance, your flight gets canceled, or delayed. What are you going to do? I'm going back home. <laughs> what else can you do, right? There's nothing I can do. Both of those flyers you just heard from are heading to Florida today, so we are hoping that they make it there safely. But in the meantime, President Joe Biden and Transportation Secretary Pete Buttigieg weighed in on the issue, and they said that the Department of Transportation is looking into what caused these delays. But the White House did say that it does not appear there's any evidence that a cyber attack is what caused all of this. That's the latest for now at LaGuardia Airport. Noelle Lilly, News 12.